There's nothing we can do to slow down the climate crisis. We might as well just give up. No, stop it. There are literally thousands of things that you can do to help slow the climate crisis. And if you choose to do only one thing, you're helping, period. And I don't just think this because I'm an idealist. I'm really not. I think this because I read the International Energy Agency's roadmap for how the world can feasibly achieve net zero emissions by 2050, which is what we have to do to get climate change under control. And one of the major things that that report says, a transition of the scale and speed described by the net zero pathway cannot be achieved without sustained support and participation from citizens. You think making a different choice at the store isn't going to matter? Wrong! Around 55% of the cumulative emissions reductions in the pathway are linked to consumer choices, such as purchasing an EV, retrofitting a house with energy efficient technologies, or installing a heat pump. You think changing your behavior in some way won't matter? Also wrong! Behavioral changes, particularly in advanced economies such as replacing car trips with walking, cycling, or public transport, or foregoing a long-haul flight, also provide around 4% of the cumulative emissions reductions. Not a lot, but hey, that's something. You think participating in political activism? to change government policy isn't gonna matter? Wrong again, and this is by far the most important one. While it is citizens and companies that modify their behavior, the changes are mostly enabled by the policies and investments made by governments, and in some instances, they are required by laws or regulations. These types of changes do not happen without public pressure and support. Now, if you can't do any of these things right now, that is okay. Participating in activism or making different financial or behavioral choices are privileges that not everyone can afford. Seriously, if I see one more climate-concerned person shame a regular person for their choices, I'm gonna lose it. But do us all a favor, and stop saying that it's useless to do anything. Because not only is it just a lie, it's a lie that only benefits polluting corporations who would love nothing more than to have everyone just give up and allow them to continue profiting from the climate crisis. And look, I get feeling helpless. We live in a hyper-individualistic culture that teaches us to see things in either black or white. If I can fix it, it's worth doing. If I can't fix it, I give up. But this is a bad way to think about the climate crisis because the climate crisis will not be solved by one person doing one thing all at once. It will be solved by many people doing little things all at once. So what will you do? And if you are doing anything, you are helping, period.